Okay, so our next topic is the revolver. Now, if you notice the inventor, his name is Samuel Colt. Um, you've probably heard of that Colt before um, because of the fact that, like, Colt guns and things like that. So the revolver, which you can see right here, is that previously um, guns were either super long and large, so super heavy, or they were super small and inaccurate. Think Aaron Burr and Hamilton. Um, and because of that, most of the time, these guns could only hold a single bullet, and it typically took between 45 seconds and a minute and 15 seconds to actually be able to shoot your gun. So a new weapon was needed to be created. So Colt created what is known as the revolver. So if you don't know how a revolver works, you have this right here. This is the chamber. You load six bullets into the chamber. Then what happens is you cock this little thing right here, and once you go to pull the trigger, it goes back in, and it basically hits what's called the pin. And the pin hits, which is the bottom of the bullet. It causes it to spark, which hits the gunpowder, which causes the bullet to come out. Once the bullet comes out, the casing basically shoots out the back, and then it rotates, and you can shoot again. You could shoot up to six times um, during this. So it makes um, weaponry a lot more efficient, and it used the interchangeable parts from Eli Whitney to be able to create these guns. Now, however, unfortunately, um, it wasn't exactly like it was perfect, and in fact, it caused some problems. Uh, if you want to highlight, as westward expansion increased, the revolver became used for nece everyday necessity. Um, that's because as people began to move west, they used this for protection. And this also, if you want to write next to that, is the Wild West, um, as well as the, the gunslingers, you know, all these different things um, were all created because of the revolver. Um, so a little bit of a negative thing, but it did make weaponry a lot more efficient.